Good morning, sweetheart. Today I'm going to show you how to get a custom Discord banner without having the About Me beta feature. Now, mind you, there are a couple things I need to say right away, and it's first off that better Discord is against Discord's terms of service. Second, this is not visible to anyone who is not using the correct better Discord theme or better Discord, and that's because you need a specific theme to show off these custom banners. So to start out, the first thing you need to do is you need to go to the first link in the description and you will see this GitHub page. Now, you need to do this first because it takes a little bit of time to get your background to be requested correctly. So all you need to do is on this GitHub page, scroll down and you need to join their Discord server black box and then all you got to do is join black box then you got to just look around for now i'd maybe read the rules if you want to stay for a while but if you don't just scroll on down go to background requests and we need to request a background now you've noticed that this fantastic fella has requested a gif background and yes you can have a gif background anyways all you need to do is navigate to any gif right so i searched up aesthetic gifs on google and i found this page and all you need to do is first save the gif so save image as giphy whatever who cares and just upload it to your discord server so i love my fart knife discord server and i'm going to drag it into there and when i do that i'm going to click upload and once it uploads i am going to right click the image click copy link and if I paste it into a browser, I should notice that it is a discord.app and it's a giphy.gif. All I need to do is do a background request on the black box server. So BG exclamation mark request, then paste in the discord link and it will create a request. Now, all you need to do is you need to click on the link underneath your request and you will see the status of it. And generally speaking, depending on if the GIF is safe for work or not, your GIF will either be accepted or declined. Specifically, this is manually done by the admin of the server. Do not ping him. That is very annoying, and most likely he'll just shut you down. So you will need to wait. Now, while you're waiting, you actually need to download Better Discord. So go to the second link in the description, and you will see betterdiscord.app. Click Download v1.1.1. It will download the application. And once it downloads, you want to click on it to open up the installer. And while the installer is opening, once again, I just want to say better Discord is against Discord's terms of service. But I've already told you once, and I've told you twice. So at this point, you can't just throw in the comments, better Discord is against Discord's terms of service. Anyways, I'm stalling. Click I accept the license agreement. Click next. Click next again. Then click on the Discord version you have. If you don't see Discord version here, reinstall Discord. And after you click on Discord, click install, and it should install better Discord. Now, while we're doing that, we need to go to the third link in the description and you will see BDFDB. Click on the download button and it will download a JavaScript file. Now, you might get an error from Chrome popping up saying this can harm your computer. Just click on the drop down and click keep. Obviously, it didn't happen here, which is nice. But if it does happen to you, it's completely fine. It's just a JavaScript file and there's nothing wrong about it. So the one major requirement of this whole entire system is that you need a compatible theme that will show the actual background. Now, there are some themes on this list that don't work. I've noticed two that don't work, Discord TV and Frosted Glass. So your mileage may vary. Actually, it definitely will vary. But you will need to pick one of the themes in this list and you will need to try it out and see if it works. What do I mean by that? Well, you need to look at the name of the actual theme, go to the Better Discord website, and you need to click on themes. Then you need to figure out the name. I'm going to do Slate. I know 100% it works. I'm going to go to the Better Discord page and type in Slate and press enter. Then I'm going to click on the theme. Then I'm going to click download. Now, when you download it, you want to actually test if this theme works. So if you go to Discord, it should have restarted and it might pop up with a window saying, oh, Better Discord got installed. But if you're unsure if you saw that or not, just go to your user settings and you should see Better Discord in your settings section. If you see that, you did a fantastic job. If you didn't, it's in my FAQ on the Discord server. Anyways, what you need to do is you need to click on plugins. You need to click open plugins folder. It will open up behind Discord, so you need to maximize it. Then you need to scroll up, right click on downloads and click open a new window. And you need to drag in the zero BDFDB plugin. Just drag it over, it doesn't matter. And then turn it on if it's not turned on already. You'll get a change log, who cares? Just close off of all this. And once you do that, you need to go to themes, click open themes folder and it'll open up the themes folder. You need to go back to your downloads. It should still be open and you need to drag in the theme that you chose. So drag over your slate theme and all you need to do is go back into Discord and turn on the theme. Now, Slate theme is a very big change from Discord, so uh, it might be a little confusing from here on out, but just pay a little bit of attention. So go back to the black box server and you need to test whether or not your theme actually works. So 
click on anyone's name on the side. Basically, just click on people's names, and if you click on it, you might notice, damn, he's got a background, but they don't have the custom about beta feature that shows up on a couple of people's stuff. Like this one, it shows beta on the top right, but Absol here has an animated background, and they don't have a beta, and that's because we're using the this thing that we're using that I'm showing you, basically. Now, as you see, my request that I have put in has been accepted. Mind you, that took about, you know, a certain amount of time that I don't want to worry about. If I click on my name, you'll notice I have the animated background, which looks absolutely sick. So that's basically how it works. Mind you, if it doesn't work with a theme, you need to try a different theme. There's no way of really fixing it. You could nag the developer of the actual theme, but in my case, I couldn't be bothered to ask the developers to fix their theme, so I just picked a different one. If you ever want to change it, all you need to do is go back to the background requests, and you need to request a new background like normal. You don't need to do a remove command. All you got to do is just request it again. They'll approve it, and it'll get updated. I would highly recommend you maybe just picking one and sticking with it because changing it every single second is going to make the developers a little peeved, to be completely honest. And that wraps up the installation portion of the video. If it worked, like and subscribe. And if you want to support the channel even further, just turn off your ad blocker when you watch my videos. And if for some odd reason it didn't work out for you, feel free to leave a comment in the comment section or join my Discord and put your issue in the help channel and I will help you out as soon as I can. Now let's get on to the uninstall portion of the video. Now let's say you don't want any of this anymore. I want out of the whole entire ecosystem a better Discord. Well, all you need to do is click on your file explorer, go to your downloads, open up the installer. You know you have to use the installer to uninstall it, uh, believe it or not. Anyways, click I accept the license agreement, click next, then click uninstall better Discord, click next, click on the Discord version you installed it to, then click on install, and it should restart Discord. If it doesn't, make sure to close Discord. And once it restarts, guess what, baby? Back to normal, as you can see. No theme, click on user settings, and I don't have better Discord in my settings anymore. And that is how to get a banner that only works with better Discord users that are using the correct theme, that doesn't show up for anyone else who's not using better Discord, and is, uh, uh, there's a third point somewhere. Anyways, that's the end of the video. I'm gonna go scrap with a beaver and figure out if I am truly the strongest boy in the West. I'm not. I love you. Mwah.